Welcome, folks, to the Western Carolina Writers Showcase here at Ayer Prana. I want to start by thanking everyone for being here. Um, I want to thank the venue for hosting, and I want to thank the artists for participating. We, uh, we've been putting these shows on for a while now, and uh, it's basically an in-the-round singer-songwriter-style show where artists take turns playing their original material, and uh, it's usually a pretty good time, I'm not going to lie to you. Um, we put these shows on you know, throughout the year, so if you want to check out our social media, uh, on Facebook and the Instagram at Western Carolina Writers, you can find our next show. Uh, I'm sure these artists are going to tell you a ton about themselves, so I'm going to cut the BS and I'm going to get straight to the first round. Down on the far end, we have Tin Roof Echo. In the, in the middle, hold up. Oh, sorry. In the middle, we have Rocky Collin. And last but not least, Wilbur Lane. And I think we're going to let Tim Echo kick off the night tonight. So enjoy. How you guys doing? Okay. Tonight's going to be really special. You're going to hear a lot of amazing talents. Uh, you guys ready? All right, let's do this. Well, I'm driving down a country road And I'm feeling mighty fine Cause there's something in my pocket That will help us pass the time What was it that you said before I thought is mighty kind And we won't be telling stories But we're making up our minds About love Drive along the river scene, we pass the vacant sign. The one that makes us wonder if we could be driving blind. We're not allowed to speak when drastic toes are combined. But when the math is lecture, I believe it all in time. Hold up.
What's up, everybody? I'm Wilbur Lane. Got a back brace on. Times is hard. Here's a sad song about a woman. <laughs> We're the same kind of lonely when we met those years ago. Each thinking of the other only. Searching for
like the brilliance of some old forgotten way Across the water, oh, I see her goodbye us all Yeah, the moment embraces this song When I miss you as I grow crazy chord progression, so I'm going to do my best. It's quite the upgrade from my A minor, E minor, G, <laughs> but um, I wrote this song just about feeling bored and restless, which is just all too familiar for me. <laughs> Thank you. 
got to do some uh, finagling here, so I guess I can talk to you for a second. I wrote this song while I was uh, scrubbing pies and pans and stuff at work. It's a train song, and it's a train song because while I was scrubbing all those pots and pans, I was having one of those bad days. Like, like you know the kind where you're, where you're like scrubbing pots and pans for a living and you're going, why, why am I here doing this right now? This is my history degree from Clemson University dangling around my neck. A friend of mine from the trumpet section came up to see me tonight, so thank you. Tiger band. Anyhow, I was having one of those days and then a whole bunch of trains went by because the place where I worked was kind of, you know, near that rail hub on Riverside and uh, I heard all those trains go by and I was thinking about movement and uh, it made me think about moving toward a better place so I wrote this Gonna take a little ride in a long black Cadillac way out of town where there ain't no train track Don't call my name cause I can't come back I got to move along
verse, and um, it's about social anxiety, but often in the moment I feel like a little squirrel running on a wheel doing my best, and usually it's the next day where I have a shame over. Um, and this is about the next day, and it actually was a nice day, so it's kind of about having a shame over the nice day. Darling, won't you come home soon? 
other lover by my side. And then the song doesn't resolve. <laughs> uh, there really is something about live music and that brings us together, like just this little community that we have here tonight. You guys are, you're gonna find Hopefully, all nine players interesting, and you're going to connect with at least one of them. Anyways, that's why this, this series is so important, the, the Western Carolina Writers thing, is keep going and bring more of uh, the area songwriters together. It's a cool thing, you guys. Anyways, this is going to be my last song. I think it's our last round. I know you're sad about that, right? Okay. Anyways, I hope you'll indulge me with this next song. Uh, this one is all true. And I wish my I wish my family was here right now because uh, this song really originated from a, a conversation that I had with my son. We asked where his younger sister came from. Don't worry, this is not about the birds and the bees. I know some of y'all started shifting in your seats. You're like getting a little uncomfortable. Son, you were a little bitty baby when your mom come along and said, well, maybe we should have another one of you youngs just around us now. She said, sure can, now wasn't that the plan to lay by the fire. We started getting tired of all of that talking and all the talking. Well, it led to this. Well, I've done all these things and now we know. Showing in. She was the most beautiful thing you ever saw. You know, I jumped in a lake and almost didn't make it to the birth of my sweet little baby on the way, but everything sort of worked itself out. And now, and I'm so glad because.
up the story after all I'm over 40 If I really don't feel like an old time and foggy But life has kicked my ass on down the road Tell me that you want me still. such good company and uh and and just just surrounded by this incredibly supportive community that we have the the privilege of uh existing in this um this song is about uh imagining what 
healthy looks like. And it's, uh, it's, it's something that I needed for myself. I wrote it for myself and I want to offer it to you. She calls me sunshine. Thank you. 